Um, first of all, uh, well, of course, first of all, she's very caring, talaga. That's a given. And parang into music then like wow okay <laughs> okay i can make like i i mean i can i have someone that i can make songs with and uh ayun ayun po parang she's very family oriented then very family oriented tapos boto sa family nila <laughs> boto sila sa iyo baliktad hindi boto sila ako ay ano, boto si- boto ko sa nanay ko hindi hindi no wait what's yeah <laughs> no yeah yeah basta yun and then her family her family loves me though So mm-hmm. that's, a, that's another thing, and of course, Alexa. Of course, Alexa is um, very yeah. Joa material. Very <laughs> 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 Joa material. <laughs> Thank you. Ikaw, ikaw, Alexa. Naman, hindi sa wag 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 sa nang lumaki ulo mo ha. Pero mm. para sa akin, actually lahat. Actually, kahit sa loob ng bahay pa lang. Dati tinatanong ko pa sa kanya kung may mga marireto siya sa akin na katulad niya. Kasi, I mean, siya talaga kasi yung type. Eh, ba't ko, ba't ko mapaparito ako na lang? Dati na nga, dati nga, dati nga. So, kasi yun nga, mahilig sa music. Yun talaga, sobrang laking bagay talaga nun. Because music is my life. Um, and, I don't know, he's really, he's really sweet. He's, loves my dog very good um, and my cats very good um loves my niece very good so basta lahat naman lahat actually everything it it feels really feels really healthy so it's really nice yeah thank you and last na um nabanggit niyo kasi yung music pa ulit-ulit if my song top of mind song for each other ano yun baka pwede yung pa sample ng line kayong dalawa pag top of mind song ba about Alexa and ikaw pag nabanggit si KD kanya ano ba chorus na kahit one or two lines lang what's the lyrics ikaw KD ano sa'yo ay kailangan one, one ah one how uh, do you say that na like, is it better for you just to do it both okay, okay so isa lang ba yung kanta niya okay, okay. Yes. favorite song kasi namin to yeah. Okay. Yeah. I want to. What's least about it? I want to be. And I play the fool and lean into you. Whatever this is, whatever we are, you have my heart. Oh, thank you so much. Congratulations. Thank you. Thanks, Thank Darla, you. Justin. Nice to see you. Thank you, Kate. You're so fresh. <laughs> so fresh. So yeah, fresh. Miss Darla, uh, Katie and Al, uh, Alexa, our next set of questions will come from our phone, Belinario, TV5 and One News Philippines. Okay. Oh, hello. Hi, Justin. Hi, Darla. Hi, Katie Hi, Lex. Hi, Katie. Hi, Al. Alexa. Nice to see you again, virtually, Alexa. I know. <laughs> Alexa, Katie, since nabanggit na you're getting there, no? Um, how do you handle the pressure from the fans, from the KD Lex sweethearts when it comes to, you know, pag-ship talaga sa inyo since since PBB days. Ah, uh, ayun po. Actually, I don't really feel that pressure naman po. Kasi yeah. po, kasi po it's like what what me and Alexa have is just developing naturally. Honestly, what you yeah. see is what you get. Yeah, what you see is yeah. what you get sa amin. Like we're we're not We're not hiding. <laughs> we're not hiding and we're not pushing. We're not pushing anything. Yeah. We're just going with ano. Uh, we're just going with the flow and ano. Uh, what me and Lex have is just really natural lang talaga. It's not we're not necessarily together, but we're not not together. We're not not we're not not, we're not, not dating. <laughs> so, yeah, ako naman with our fans naman po, our sweethearts. What's really nice about them is they're so respectful. Uh, They're so they appreciate um whatever they see yeah. from us and they don't really ask you know they don't push they don't, don't push. they don't demand and they're really so respectful even with our privacy sometimes when they see candid shots from other people na 
they think we'd want it to be private, they would really say, na, guys, let's delete, let's respect yeah, their privacy. Uh-huh. So, of course, bilang artist, Thank you. we really appreciate that. That's, that's actually really hard to find. Yeah, so, super. really appreciate that. Based on your previous answers, no, from the previous questions sa mga kasamahan natin sa press, as Gen Cs, how yeah. do you define putting a label in a relationship? Kayo nga sabi nga nag enjoy kayo together. But gano'n ka-importante sa inyo to have a label when it comes to partnership, when it comes to relationship? Honestly, with me, it's really important. Kasi with that label, you can set boundaries. And with that label, no one's crossing any lines. Okay. You have a definite answer kung ano yung pwesto mo sa buhay ng tao yun. So that, well, that's also something we talked about na na about those labels. Kasi sabi ko, if walang label, tapos you act a certain way, it can get confusing in the long run, di ba? So, what's nice naman with KD is, we always have such a very open communication. Now, we can just talk about anything, kahit yung mga topic na parang mahirap siguro pag-usapan, napapag-usapan naman po namin. Kasi malawak naman yung pangunawa and yung pag-iintindi. So, magan- maganda yung... Open yung communication and very honest lang talaga sa isa't isa. Opo. Yun nga, for me, it's really, it's a must talaga eh. Opo. Kasi so no one gets hurt. Kasi kahit pa sabihin mo na you just wanna have fun, no labels, that that works for a short amount of time. Pero pag nahulog ka na, asan ka? Asan Sino ka? pupulot sa'yo? Wala kayong <laughs> labels. Parang hirap nun. Yeah. So for Opo. me, it's... Your for thoughts, me, Katie? Uh, sa akin lang naman po, I don't think, like, I don't see labels as like, oh, boyfriend, girlfriend, like that, uh, no, like that. Uh, it doesn't have to be restricted. Yeah, it doesn't have to be restricted. Yeah, yeah. Labels can be like something like, as like an understanding lang, like both of you have, na you just set, you just set certain boundaries, set, uh, set uh, rules. Not, 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 not even rules nga eh, parang guidelines, I would say. <laughs> May konting guidelines. Kasi po, um, we don't want to restrict din each other sa, uh, sa work namin. And, ayun po, that's, that's, that's what I, that's what I can say. It's just, what I can say about labels po, it's like, it doesn't have to be one word. It can be, you know, it can be whatever you guys want it to be. Basta you said, basta it's healthy for you Basta you're on the same page. Basta it's healthy for both Same page. That's so important. Basta you're on the same page and pareho kayo nang iniisip. Kasi mahirap yun pag magkaiba, hindi talaga magtutugma. Apo. Ang ganda nung sinabi ni Alexa, same page. Tama yan, girl. Siguro last question ko na lang, Katie and Alexa. Isa sa mga pinag-usapan at hinangaan ng fans ng PBB sa inyo, ako personally, napanood ko talaga yung episodes na yon. E yung pagiging open ninyo when it comes to your mental health issues. I mean, Katie and Alex, Katie has a depression you, Alexa, yung dysmorphia mo. Now na nasa labas na kayo ng bahay ni Kuya, how do you help each other? How are you coping up with each other, helping each other when it comes to your mental health um, conditions? Parang, uh, for me po, ano, I give Lex reassurance. Talaga. Uh, reassurance and uh, parang just being ano, constant. Like, just being super, ano, wait, what is that word again? Consistent, consistent pala. <laughs> consistent po sa ano sa pagtulong kay Alexa. Kasi so, she's been there for me then. She's been super consistent din inside the house helping me. And uh kahit na po, like minsan I see her, she's tired. Uh she's still there for me kahit pa no. And I really do appreciate that for her. So ayun po, like outside the house parang we uh like if if we're not feeling ano if we if we feel like there's ano something overwhelming us talaga, we we message each other agad. We tell each other agad what we're feeling. Because we have to be open. We have to be open then about their mental health. Because that's. Because how are you gonna get help if you don't? Yeah. Say anything. Yeah. For me, naman po, it's the same. Kung paano po kami sa loob ng bahay na nagdadamayan, nagsasamahan, sasamahan, sasamahan. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> nagsasamahan. Um, ganun pa rin po kami dito sa labas. And of course, now it's a bit easier because we have our phones. Yeah. We're always one call away. And ako naman with, in regards to helping KD, I just make sure that he knows and he believes that I'm here. Because sometimes it's 
we you know we get a lot of oh i'm here for you messages but that's not really it you know so i really try to make him feel that he will never be a burden to me because some people um really misjudge or underestimate our capacity to love and care for each other because they think that since we're both going through our own struggles our own mental health conditions that we can't be good support systems for, for each other when no, as a matter of fact it's actually the quite opposite i think it's perfect because yeah, we perfect. get each other we understand each other so i guess i'll just continue whatever i've been doing inside the house po, and yeah, the same. Yeah. And it's a good thing that you're, you're not just helping each other, Katie Lex. You're helping the public to create more awareness about mental health conditions. And kudos to both of, to the both of you for, for, for doing that. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you so much. I Paul. think well, we should also say thank you to PBB because they were the platform that we really used and we maximized to spread yeah. word. Yeah, thanks to PBB. Thanks to Kuya and oh, yeah. PBB. Yeah. Uh, ayun po, parang we got to spread mental health awareness. Yeah. Po, and uh, ayun po, thank you Kuya for that. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and with that, thank you so much Katie Lex and congratulations. We're looking forward for this concert and for this fan one. Thank salamat. you so much. Thank you Justin. Thank you.